there. Uh, I met with Jalen Hurd this morning, and uh, we had a conversation, and we have a great relationship. And Jalen has informed me that he intends to transfer, and uh, I support him on that. And, uh, you know, I, I'm very, very thankful for everything that he's done for our football program. But it's all about our football program and our football team and moving forward from this point forward. So I'll answer any questions you may have. Uh, one other thing uh, before I do, I know it's going to come up, uh, Shy Tuttle. Uh, we've lost Shy Tuttle for the year. And uh, whew, I, I feel really, really uh, feel for that young man. Uh, he worked so hard to get himself back in the playing condition and work so hard and so diligently in the training room. And uh, he's had a knee injury, and so he'll miss uh, the rest of the season. And he'll be going through rehab throughout the course of spring practice, and we'll see how it goes. But I love him, love him to death. And uh, it's very, very unfortunate. It's the part of that uh, adversity that we talk about in a football season. So I wanted to make sure you had that update. Star Rick Russo said, <clears throat> What's the situation situation with Jalen? Is it a byproduct much of the losses and what's happened this season with regard to injuries, et cetera? Or is it something that the young man has been thinking about for a while? And do his teammates possibly perceive that as quitting? Well, I think it's a combination of a long football season, been contemplating that. And I don't want to speak for Jalen. There's a lot of things that uh, you know go into that decision. And I guess the only thing I'll say is, uh, you know, I value our relationship and have a lot of respect for that young